In this tutorial, we will learn how to create tangent edge with the help of edge flange. So we have one simple sheet. See, these lines are tangent and these are different. So let's activate edge flange. Now here first I'm going to choose edge. So let's say this one. And here let's say defined length 30 okay now i'm going to select the second edge now if i'm going to use this tangent edge i'm not able to select why because we already selected one edge which is not tangent with this edge if i'm going to clear and now i'm going to select this edge this line is tangent with this edge now select this one now see let's rotate now if i am going to select these other lines which is not tangent with this edge it will not select see i am trying to select these edges will not and rest thing keep as it is if you want to change radius gap or the angle let's say 70 now here we we applied length of this and this is the position from dimension from virtual sharp edge material we keep inside bend now even though if you add offset let's say 20 millimeter oh that's going to be too big 10 20 even though if you don't like just simply uncheck offset now even custom release custom relief type now see here we have a custom type rectangular and ratio shows 0.5 means 50 percent if you want to change let's say if you keep one the both the ratio become one one means two millimeter two millimeter say okay now look if you choose flatten and you will get this option so this is how you can use age flange to create a tangent flange the main thing is we have to select only all the tangent edges together don't forget to share and like our video and please subscribe our channel for more video and more projects in solidworks thanks for watching